I recorded the video that you are about to see with my mobile phone on August 14th, 2023. The questions that you will surely ask after this video, you probably won't find or get answers to anywhere, but you will have to figure it out for yourself. Based on the logic of what you will see with your own eyes, remember this picture where the satellite shoots the beam towards the Earth. So you will compare it with the situation I took. North America, Canada. I don't know if I have to circle it for you or if you notice it yourself. And now the million dollar question. What is this circle? I've run this weather program maybe a hundred times by now, and I've never seen anything remotely like this glowing circle. I haven't found any explanations anywhere. That would explain at least a little bit what we are looking at. A natural rare occurrence or, shall we try a little conspiracy theory? A satellite that shoots some kind of beam from the Earth's atmosphere to cause the fires that are currently raging in Canada. I won't even mention these glowing lines that you see, as they have already become a common occurrence. If you compare all the lines that you will see in this video, you will notice that the same ones are repeated in my previous videos. Glowing lines are always visible around Vancouver. As far as I've noticed from previous videos, storms always form there. As far as I'm aware of these storms, they are a frequent occurrence in the US. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't recall seeing straight glowing lines across US states. I could be wrong. The USA has really nasty storms. I think their storms are a natural occurrence, but I'm not so sure about the rest of the world. Prove me wrong. Let's go now to examine Europe, to see the situation on my continent. Circles are being formed again around Bulgaria. Serbia and Romania. Normally, long lines are faintly visible around the circles aiming at the center of the circles. After a certain time, storms are created in these places. If you happen to be from the respective countries and haven't had a storm, please correct me in the comments and tell me I'm wrong. It would be easier for me to find out that all those glowing lines, circles and perfect shapes are just a bug in the timing program or that I'm misreading the data from this program. As you can see, the program can show me the events for a period of one hour. Now let's check the situation in Asia. This looks to me like normal clouds with possible rain. We have to be a little patient because I'm still watching on my mobile phone so the program is a little slow. These three white circles mean that the map is loading. Let's take a look at China, where there were recent catastrophic floods. It is difficult to load the map near China, so I will show you China in the next video. Let's go to Spain.
straight glowing lines appear again between Spain and Algeria. Don't forget to subscribe so you get notified when I put up my new video, where you'll see massive super sail storms over Europe and footage of floods over China that claim thousands of lives. I think this is another natural storm in the USA. What do you think? What are the logical explanations for all this? Global warming, natural phenomena, or? Write in the comments. Let's see what the camera shows from this place. Is this just the lens that amplified the reflection of the sun or? A lot of cameras don't work as if they are frozen, coincidence, or... If you liked this video, then wait until you see the next one. Be sure to watch my next video. It may be the last of its kind if I don't come across another shocking unseen phenomenon. The more you like and share a video like this, the more the YouTube algorithm will recommend it to others to spread the truth.